Good Day Aerial TV Defense. Today we will talk about Comparison of Philippines FA-50 Fighter Jets vs China JL-9 Fighter Jets. And I'm gonna put the full details of this, both aircraft. Before we start, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you. This Philippines FA-50 and China JL-9 is a two-seat supersonic fighter trainer jets. But we will talk about first. How powerful is Filipinas FA-50 fighter jets? The Philippines F-50 a is a light combat aircraft manufactured by Korea Aerospace Industries, CHI, for the Republic of Korea Air Force, ROKIF. It is a light combat version of the T-50 Golden Eagle, supersonic advanced jet trainer and light attack aircraft. The F-A-50 is a light combat aircraft manufactured by Korea Aerospace Industries, CHI, for the Republic of Korea Air Force, ROKIF. It is a light combat version of CHI T-50 Golden Eagle supersonic advanced jet trainer and light attack aircraft. Development of the F-A-50 combat aircraft began in October 1997. Six prototypes were built during the development phase that concluded in January 2006. The F-A-50 was awarded military type certificate by the Korean Military Aircraft Airworthiness Committee MOC, in October 2012. It is the first fighter class military aircraft to receive the mock certification. The indigenously developed Kai FA-50 light attack aircraft replaced the Rokoff's aging fighter fleet of F-5 EF and A-37 aircraft. The FA-50 also strengthens the defense capability of the Rokoff Lockheed Martin Sniper Advanced Targeting Pod ATP, will be integrated onto the FA-50 platform by August 2020. The Sniper Pod is anticipated to obtain certification by the end of 2020. The FA-50, which is based on the T-50 supersonic advanced trainer platform, is offered as an affordable and efficient supersonic advanced light attack platform. The combat aircraft is intended to meet the light fighter requirements of air forces around the world. The advanced radar provides the FA-50 jet with detection capability which is similar to that of the KF-16 fighter. The F-A-50 measures 13.14 meters in length, 9.45 meters in width, and 4.82 m in height. The empty weight of the aircraft is 6.47 tons. It can take off with a maximum gross weight of 12.3 tons. Kai F-A-50's tandem glass cockpit can carry two crew members, it is equipped with a wide field of view head-up display, HUD, color multifunction displays, MFTs, digital engine instrumentation, hands-on throttle and stick, HOTAS, integrated, upfront controls, and zero-zero ejection seat. The flight control systems include digital, fly-by-wire, active stick, electrical emergency power unit, digital brake-by-wire and triple redundant electrical system. The cockpit also integrates an onboard oxygen generation systems OBOX, the night vision imaging system and VIS aboard the aircraft ensures mission capability during day and night. The avionics package consists of embedded inertial navigation system global positioning system INS GPS integrated mission computer identification friend or foe IFF radar altimeter multimode radar, store, management system, UHF VHF radio, tactical data link, data transfer and recording system, radar warning receiver, RWR, and countermeasure dispensing system, CMDS. FA-50 aircraft can carry a weapons load of up to 4.5 T. The aircraft can be armed with AIM-9 Sidewinder, short-range air-to-air missiles, a Gram M65 Maverick air-to-ground tactical missiles, AGM, GBU-38 per byte joint direct attack munitions, JDAM, BU-105 sensor-fused weapon, SFW, M, K-82 low drag general purpose, LDGP, bombs and cluster bomb units, CBUS. The aircraft is also mounted with an internal, 3-barrel 20mm Gatling gun and LAU-3 per R-19 tube 2.75 Rocket launcher for firing folding fin aerial rockets, FFAR 
The wide range of weapon systems aboard the F-A-50 jet allows it to counter multiple threats in today's complex battlefield scenario. The power plant of the Kai F-A-50 aircraft integrates a General Electric F-404GE-102 turbofan engine developing 17,700 pound forces of thrust with afterburner. The engine's performance is controlled by dual-channel full-authority digital engine control FADIC, system. The fuel is supplied from the internal fuel tanks. The aircraft can carry 568L of additional fuel in its external fuel tank. The power plant provides a maximum speed of 1,837.5 km per hour. After we heard about Philippines FA-50. Let's talk about now how powerful is China JL-9, the China Gazhu JL-9, also known as the FTC-2000 Mountain Eagle, is a two-seat, supersonic fighter trainer developed by the Gazhu Aviation Industry Import-Export Company. GAIC, for the People's Liberation Army Air Force, PLOF, and the People's Liberation Army Naval Air Force, PLANIF. The FTC-2000 is a JJ-70 RFT-7 with a new wing, a forward fuselage with side air intakes, and a glass cockpit. The engine, empennage, and mechanical controls of the JJ-70 RFT-7 are retained. The FTC-2000 Grams is a multi-role combat fighter aircraft and one of the cheapest multi-role fighters on the market with the aim to replace old legacy fighters like the J-7 per Fahrenheit 7. It has seven hard points. It also features a diverterless supersonic inlet. It made its first flight in September 2018. Compared to the FTC-2000 trainer variant, the FTC-2000 Grams is heavier, slower due to new wing design, and has less endurance than the FTC-2000. The JL-9 Grams is a modified JL-9 for aircraft carrier training. It is designed for ski jump ramp takeoffs and simulated arrested landings, land-based, and includes a tail hook. The FTC-2000 started as a Gaia private venture to develop an inexpensive trainer for fourth-generation aircraft. The trainer was revealed at the 2001 China International Aviation and AMP Aerospace Exhibition. The aircraft are reported to be produced at a gate assembly line in Anshan, Gizhu. The FTBC 2000, as the JL-9, competed with the Hongdu JL-10 to meet the advanced trainer requirements of the PLOF and PLANIF. The JL-10 is more technologically advanced, but also more expensive than the JL-9. In 2013, both had entered production. A carrier landing trainer variant was revealed by Chinese state media in 2011. Designated the JL-9 Grams, it has strengthened undercarriage, enlarged wing and diverterless supersonic inlets, but has proved to be unsuitable for arrested landings and is limited to land-based operations. On September 5, 2018, Chinese state-run Xinhua News Agency reported that GAIC had begun mass production of the FTC 2000 Grams variant. On September 28 it was reported that the first mass-produced FTC 2000 Grams performed its maiden flight. In April 2020, China reported that an unnamed Southeast Asian country had placed an order for the FTC 2000 Grams, with deliveries expected between 2021 and 2023. General Characteristics Crew, 2 length, 14.555 m, 47 feet 9 n, excluding nose pro wingspan, 8.32 m, 27 feet 4 in, height, 4.105 m, 13 feet 6 in, wing area, 26.15 m2, 281.5 square feet, gross weight, 7,800 kilograms, 17,196 pounds, clean, 7,900 kilograms, 17,417 pounds, normal max takeoff weight, 9,800 kilograms, 21,605 pounds, fuel capacity, 2,000 kg, 4,409 pounds, internal plus up to 1,302 kilograms, 2,870 pounds, in external tanks power plant, 1X, Gizhulian WP-13F, C, after burning turbojet, 
43.15 kN, 9,700 lb forces, thrust dry, 63.25 kN, 14,220 lb forces, with afterburner performance maximum speed, 1,100 km per hour, 680 miles per hour, 590 kN, slash, M1.5 unstick and touchdown speed, 260 km per hour, 160 miles per hour, 140 kn, minimum flying speed, 210 km per hour, 130 miles per hour, 110 kn, cruise speed, 870 km per hour, 540 miles per hour, 470 kn, stall speed, 125 km per hour, 78 mile per hour, 67 kn, range, 863 kilometers, 536 miles, 466 mi, on internal fuel ferry range, 2,400 kilometers, 1,500 mi, 1,300 mi, with maximum internal and external fuel endurance, 3 hours service ceiling, 16,000 m, 52,000 feet, G limits, plus 8-3 rate of climb, 150 meters per second, 30,000 feet per minute, at sea level, wing loading, 374.8 kilograms per meter to 76.8 pounds per square foot, thrust weight, 0.00645 kilonewtons per kilogram, 0.658 pound forces per pound, take off run, 400 to 500 m, 1312 to 1640 feet, landing run, 700 m, 2297 feet, armament guns, 1x, 23 mm cannon, 16, hard points, 5 with a capacity of 2000 kg, 4409 pounds, maximum, with, provisions to carry combinations of, other up to 3x fuel tanks, 16, missiles, typically, 2 XPL 8 AAMs on inboard pylons plus 2 XPL 9 AAMs on outboard pylons avionics pulse doppler, radar comms IFF transponder EFIS HOTAS GPS slash INS. This both aircraft is same in, configuration and era. And we don't know why the Chinese name their JL-9 known as, Mountain Eagle while the Philippines FA-50 known as Fighting Eagle. The Philippine FA-50, is the first who use Eagle word than the Chinese JL-9. Now, we know that this aircraft, is similar but in system and capabilities is different. The Philippines FA-50 is much, powerful than China JL-9. How about you aerial TV defense? Who is the best fighter, trainer aircraft? You decide. If you are new to my channel please like share, and subscribe, don't forget to click the bell to notify you if I have a new video.